No, it's fine. Old habits die hard, huh? I am shocked he seems mellowed out. Kind of. <laughs> yeah, we know who you are. Behind bars, man. Captain Soashiro! I, I thought you were in the slammer. W what are you doing here? You were found guilty. You killed the Seiryu chairman. As Ebbing is concerned, you're public enemy number one, right? At a glance, I'd say he's treating you like the opposite. You know, for a dumbass, you're pretty perceptive, huh, Ichi? And I see you're at it with that. Would it kill you to be nice for once? <laughs> I guess old habits really do die hard. So they do. So, uh... What exactly is going on? Well, long story short, I wasn't the one who killed Chairman Hoshino four years ago. I what? <laughs> no, that shocks me. We saw you with the gun. It... Mm -hmm. Oh. late to the party, aren't you? <laughs> Seems even Hoshino got sick of waiting. Oh, you bastard. Young master, what have you done? Yeah, I should be asking you. The ruthless Captain Sawashiro I once knew never dragged his ass. But I have a theory. You let it slip that someone was after the old man's head. Didn't you? If all went according to plan, Ichiban would come save the day before you made the hit. That's what you were banking on, right? Well, change of plans. I see. So you sent a guy in ahead of me to ensure the job was done. I'll make sure the credit goes to you. If it gets around that you off the Seiryu clan chairman, <laughs> well, you're sure to impress a cellmate or two. So then... That means I'd lost your trust some time ago, young master. You're wrong there, Sawashiro. You never had my trust to begin with. His own son. Oh, that sucks. Because, <laughs> yeah, the original plan is he called the police, sent a tip that basically he was going... No, he called the Gomi Jewel... Gave a tip saying that he was going to have a hit on him and he was going to get killed. Sawashiro wanted to get caught in the act and beat up before he killed him. But instead, his the young master, who is actually his son, just stabbed him in the back and framed him. Oh, and that has to hurt. Wow, so you're not that big of a dick to actually kill him. <laughs> that sucks, though. And then he lights up a cigarette and we come on through. So someone else got to him before you even had the chance. Right. Then the young master played you as well. And even knowing that, you still took the fall. Well, I can't deny I was on my way to kill the chairman. Maybe I did pray for a sort of miracle. 
that by some chance I wouldn't have to. But it would have been too shameless of me to plead innocence. You had your reasons. I'm sure a lot was going through your head at the time, yeah? Uh, it's true. I suppose I was trying to atone for my sins somehow. That would also explain why he went through the entire story about the two coin locker babies and all this and that about, you know, how you know Master is actually his son. We'll explain that entire story, why he told us. It was clear the young master. No. My own son was only sinking deeper into the abyss. I spoiled him, and Arakawa-san's death was a direct result of that. In truth, I might have prevented it, but instead I pushed him to do it. Captain Sarshiro didn't kill the chairman, he took full responsibility even though it wasn't him. Either way, I could have sworn he had a life sentence, just how did he get out of here? Once they put me in prison, I thought I'd just be counting down the rest of my days. But someone put that countdown on hold. That someone was Ebina. A man claiming to be his attorney came to visit. He told me he could prove me innocent. That he wanted to appeal for a retrial. So Ebina knew the truth? Did he know about Chairman Hoshino? That there was another killer? Yeah. He's a sharp one, that guy. Real young, full of energy type. He did everything he could to get me out of prison. It was all to serve his goal, to start up the second great dissolution. You even heard it yourself just now. Arakawa still had a lot more to do before he passed. I get it. You couldn't be the one Yakuza left out of all this. <sighs> no way. I'm the guy that turned from the Tojo to the Omi, incited a war and went on an all-out rampage in the process. Get someone like me on your leash? And even a fresh face like Ebina is sure to turn a few heads. To keep the strays in line, you need someone who can bark over them. I suppose that's why he brought me in. Sounds like you got the short end of that one. I'd say it's the perfect job for me. <laughs> All things considered. If nothing else, it sure beats pretending to atone for my sins in some cell. Captain. I had asked Ebina to bring you here tonight, but it wasn't so I could talk about myself. I know I have no right, Ichi, but I have a favor to ask you. So Joe wasn't that bad a, a favor? guy, technically. From me? That's shocking. It's a rush job, too. Uh-huh. You want me to do something for well, you? Let me now? hear it first. I don't exactly want to bite off more than I can chew, you know? Done that before. Well, as I understand it, you're fresh out of a job, right? I'm sure you'll find the time. <sighs> oh, we're going to a cutscene. This is going to be important. Or not. Never mind. So, Sawashiro asks you a favor, and without any clue as to what it is, you run off and snag a passport. Sir, yes, sir, eh? That's one way to put it. Well, whatever his favor is, I imagine you'll be heading overseas, right? Passport ain't good for much else. He's gonna fill me in later today. Said he'll be waiting at Heian Tower. Are you gonna be okay by yourself? I mean, can we really trust Sawashiro? You know, I think if he was gonna hurt me, he'd have done it by now. That's a fair point. <laughs> yep. Not only that, I'm out of work, with plenty of time to spare. Figured I'd just go meet him. I'd feel bad turning him down at this point, especially after he came to me for help. Which shocks Guess we're me. we're all going to Heian Tower, then. <laughs> You're not the only one with time on his hands, after all. Captain Sarshiro's waiting at Heian Tower. About time I figured out what his big favor is. It's pretty far, so I might as well take a taxi. All right. One second. Is there a setting in which I can adjust? No, not you. Display. No. 
I should just turn the music down about 10. Uh, I'm looking for something. I'm sorry if, uh, you know. No, 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 no. Cutscene quality. Hmm. Let's turn on no, high. Definitely high. Normal, white. Speaker's name. That's always nice. Oh, please. I don't need that. I don't need that. Normal. UI. That's fine. Auto pause. Damn it. Where's the speed the text goes at? You guys move it too fast sometimes for me. It's like I read it really fast to my head, but not. Oh, no, 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 no. Alright, I guess we'll live. Alright. Oh, wait. Oh, that's the raid. Oh, I never listened to that radio show. Darn. Before the end of chapter one. I'll make sure to do that. I really will. Alright, let's see if we have any side quests on our map. All right. Oh wait, what? You can just do that? Oh, you can? Huh. All right, let's see. Um, the city is basically the same. There just isn't, there's no, I want to go up here. I want to see something actually. You know what? I'm going to do it. I want to go around because I got a feeling I'm about to leave in Jincho. I just say in Jincho. Yeah, in Jincho. I want to see a few things. Might as well run around town and reminisce. First things first. Is this still Ichiban Confections? That's the building where Ichiban Holdings used to be. Ah, okay, so that is canon. We actually moved up to number one, and that is the building that we took over. Nice. Right now we're going down a little bit of memory lane because, oh, purple guys. Now, can I go to Hello Work and change my job? Probably not because they're, you know, not happy with us. All right, let's see what these guys can do. They're level nine. Oh wait, what? Namba? You okay? I can't move Namba. Now I can move him. That was weird. Alright. I'm up! You're in it now! Let's go! God damn it, I can't time it. The Y seems faster now. And let's not forget my, uh. Okay. Damn it. Let's get it done! Let's go! Oh, actually. see what do we have up here so I got a feeling we're about to leave this place with it being the chapter Hawaiian so I wanna oh hello you have blue on you are you special you feel like fishing lend you a rod for a hundred yen thanks I'll give it a try hope you catch a lunk lunker I have no idea what I'm doing I got mysterious seaweed. And I have to buy the rod off you every time, don't I? Okay. I don't want to get in a fight at the moment. I'm gonna go around. I got some supreme herb, man. Oh, they took the dragon cart sign down. 
All right, so Dragon Card's no longer here, which is a shame. I think they could have in innovated a little. Okay, now let's see. Where was... Let's try an arcade, the Sasaki Arcade. Also, I like how quick you can choose a taxi and just go now instead of going to your smartphone, selecting the location, or sorry, the area, and then the location you want to go to. Oh, no, now I want it. Also, the taxi people don't talk to you. All right, let's see what is the arcade. Whatever spike out is, and bass fish. Yeah, more spike out, and all right. So it looks like it's only those two. Perhaps I have they slept well last night. Ah, I don't know what these are. <laughs> One second, I gotta go do something real quick. I am sorry about that. I gotta go do something. Okay. So I'm gonna try Spike Out on easy. I'm gonna try it once. I have no idea what Spike Out is. <sighs> Let's see. Well, oh, there it is. Team Spike. Oh, the team. Oh, it's not called Spike Out. Whoops. I'm like, oh yeah, let's play. Tension, Spike, Linda, White. You know, tension looks cool. Oh, this is Spike Gow. Yeah. Okay. How to seek the start Player boss. Oh. Here comes the boss. Oh, this is a little different than I thought it'd be. This is interesting. All right, I actually really like this. He's still alive. Oh, no, he's not. Get out of my way. Oh, I'm being tackled. Oh, not good, not good. There. Boy, oh, ooh, grapple. Area one, clear. 
Oh, yeah, I got some health back. special attack, but I don't know how to do it. Oh, is that it? No? Okay. that Mickey. Probably sucking real bad because I'm on easy, but still, I like it. Take that, Motley Crew. I like the music, don't worry. This fight's a helicopter. This is gonna be interesting. I'm dead. Nah, I'm not gonna continue, but that was fun. I think we saw enough of that. And we all, I'm not gonna do the best pro fishing game, because I can already imagine what that... Yeah, I got a feeling. Yeah, that's Sega Bass Fit Pro Fishing. If you, yeah, I've played that before. I'm not gonna bother playing it here, because I'll just take up more time, but I know how those games work. Okay, so I messed with the arcade bit. So, let's see. With the, so, what else do I want to look at before we go there? 
I'm gonna go here. I want to see if that's actually open. That's actually... Sp I'm curious. I want to see if... Plants Workshop is still open, because it's not on my map. Also, if I go in the Hello Work... Oh, wait, did they stick the sign out? Ah. If I go to the Hello Work, am I allowed to change my job? Nope. But makes sense. I don't I know they don't want anything to do with me. Alright, let's go south. I'm curious. Today's payday, so I should buy something for mom before I go home. Now I finally have a job. I wanna do all I can to make her life easier. Ah, that's a good guy right there. All right, Romance Workshop is... Well, the big giant bird there is gone and... Oh. I think they might have closed up shop. I upgraded you all the way, and this is what you do to me? And again, it has been, what, four years? Yeah, four years. That's what I was doing. Hmm? Somebody! Hey! Okay, so if you hit the X button, I'd, I, I was like, why do I keep shouting? No. Hey! Hmm? Somebody! Yeah. Oh, hi guys, how you doing? Ah, uh, let's teleport. I think I've looked at enough. And then over here was the Tojo Clan Crest Cellar, which I doubt they're there too. Gigo Mong Jong. Alright, let's just go to Ian Tower. There's not much I can do. I mean, I guess I can keep playing that arcade game, which I actually like. Lava fragments for some reason. It's a Tory gay. That's right, I remember. You know what, guys? Before we leave, let's have some food. <laughs> Yirashi. Yep, I know how it works. There goes all my money, but we're doing it. Oh, I'm starving. I'm real. That's great. I got the And we are partially wasted, but not fully wasted to the point I lose control. You know what? I'm gonna beat you up. Now we're talking. Watch this. Goodbye, guys. Oh, wow. Nice. Hello, ma'am. A toy bracelet, which is really good, and a wrap binding. Basic, basic stuff. Like, very basic. Accidentally stop screaming. All right, let's go to Hian Tower after I save here. Walkathon. Hmm, nice. Ah, to think there'd come a day when we'd share a meal here. I'll say. Still, I assumed it'd just be us. 
Actually, they're here on Ebina's orders. <laughs> I made a lot of enemies before getting arrested. Plenty of people out there still hate my guts, it seems. I'm going to take off the names for the subtitles after. That's nah, unneeded. Oh, I did what you asked. Got my passport right here. Ah, excellent. So, uh, what's this favor you're asking? I'm sending you to Hawaii. There's someone there who wants to meet you. Hawaii? Uh, who is it? Well, it's your mother. Wait, what? I thought she was dead. What? She's the one woman the boss truly loved. Akane-san. Huh? Wh wait, that's... Just so we're clear here, yes, you are indeed the boss and Akane-san's child. That fateful day 40 years ago, I saw everything with my own eyes. On that day, two babies at the coin lockers were sadly mistaken for one another. And that was Ichiban they took away. In a perfect world, you would have been raised as Masato Arakawa, the boss's own flesh and blood. You were, of course, replaced with... <sighs> the son I abandoned. If you hate me for it, you're welcome to say so. You have every right. You know, I've always had two fathers. Jiro Kasuga at the Shangri-La Soapland, and by oath, Masumi Arakawa. For what it's worth, that's all I needed. Maybe you're right. That said, what about your mother? Right, uh, so, uh, this Akane-san lady is... Yes. She's your mom. No, but... Akane-san, I, I heard she was killed. Heck, Arakawa-san told me himself. The Hikawa family hunted her down. You know, the guys Arakawa-san used to roam with. Right, well, that may be what the boss believed. But it's not entirely true. <sighs> Prior to the boss's departure, the patriarch of the Hikawa family hoped to marry Arakawa-san to his daughter. That's how much he liked him. You might even say the Patriarch wanted him as his heir. But as fate would have it, the boss was already together with Akane-san. So he had to fearfully turn down the offer. Right. That was it. And the Patriarch's rage upon hearing the news was more than the boss could have ever imagined. In a sudden turn, he tried to kill both the boss and Akane-san who at the time was pregnant with you. Oh, I heard a lot. Oh. He also said I kind of didn't make it, that he couldn't protect her in the end. You see, the boss had heard Akane-san was caught by the Hikawa family, but he never saw her body for himself. He kept believing she was out there, and so he strung up one Hikawa member after another. But by then, it was too late, and the order to kill Akane-san had already been passed on to the contractors. Contractors? Professional hitmen. So now they were on the hunt too. The Hikawa Patriarch was playing all his cards. All that to kill Akane-san? Just her alone? Crossing the Yakuza carries a heavy toll. Surely, I don't have to tell you that. Mm. It was then, Arakawa made one last move. And in order to save your mom, he raided the Hikawa family HQ. All by himself.
Oh, it's weird to see young boss again. Arakawa! You're going straight to hell, you damn traitor! <laughs> 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 Yeah, he's not a first kill. He's no cure. You. This must be the rear Arkawa the Assassin. Does not fear oh, death. Oh, oh, oh. I've been wanting to see that face. To hear you scream like that little brat you are! Make the call! Do it already! <laughs> One really has to wonder, though. How bad is your bitch holding up? Oh, shooting off being so finger. <laughs> the boss continued torturing the Hikawa Patriarch until he breathed his last. But no matter what he did, the madman kept on laughing. Till the bitter end. Holy cow. <laughs> Both of them are badasses. One's scary, one's just and in the end, laughing in the face of death. He never found out where Akane san was. And now he had no chance of calling off her pursuers. But wait. He knew she was headed for the Philippines, right? 
There had to be something he could do. There was. He flew to the Philippines as soon as possible, and once he formed his own family, his subordinates joined the search. But nothing ever turned up, and the years just kept passing by. He came to believe that if Akane-san were alive, she would have contacted him. That day never came. So he and the rest of us assumed the worst. Though no one ever said it out loud. Here. It's the photo of Akane-san the boss had us carry around. What? I can't imagine you've seen it. This is her? Akane-san? Oh. That's true. She's He's never actually Hawaiian, seen a picture of her. Albeit with some Japanese blood mixed in. Then I have that blood too? Guess that's how it goes. Man, seeing her after all this time, the woman the boss loved. Ten years had passed since Akane's son went missing. Then, one day the boss got an emergency call. It was from an officer of a Filipino group we had dealings with. He found a girl in Hawaii who looked just like her. Then that mean... maybe she moved back home at some point? Yeah, we'd been looking at that angle too, as you might have guessed. But the boss never knew where exactly in Hawaii she was born. That might be why we still came up short. So you went there to take a look? To find Akane-san? Soon as I got word, I was on the first flight out. It was just me, though. The boss stayed behind. Why? What? Why didn't he go with me? If I can afford to be blunt, it's because he was afraid. He'd had enough. A man can only have his hopes built up so many times. The stronger and more promising the lead, the bigger the hurt when it all fell through. I see. Makes sense. Anyway, off I went. <sighs> Eventually I found her. It was Akane's son, no doubt about it. And she was safe and sound? She was. About as safe as you can get. Granted, uh, that presented a bit of a problem for me. Huh? Say all went well, and she returned to the boss. Akane-san would inevitably want to meet her child. And in that case, she'd quickly see that her son's been living with a handicap since the transfer at the coin locker. Now, she might at first say that just being able to reunite is enough. But eventually, she'd want to know about his condition. And she'd probably ask how that happened. Before long, she and the boss would be comparing their memories from that night. Then it'd hit. They'd realize they transferred their baby at different lockers. How then would they treat Masato Arakawa, the young master, the boy they believed was theirs? Uh, well... No one truly knows what would have happened. But I did know this. As long as Akane-san kept out of Japan, everything here'd stay the same. Neither I nor the young master would have to suffer. Wait, then you... You flew out to Akane-san, too. Oh, you want the killer. Exactly. When I saw Akane-san, I was planning to kill her. To make sure the young master stayed as Arakawa's son. <laughs> Even I couldn't help trembling. I had every intention to get rid of the woman the boss loved. However, I ended up walking away. 
All thanks to something she said. If anyone asks, I've been dead a long time. And Akane-san has kids out there? It shouldn't come as a surprise if you think about it. A young girl on the run from hired killers. With absolutely no hope of contact from the man she loved. Who could blame her for anything? From then on, it was her life to live. So I decided to honor her wishes. I gave word to the boss that Akane-san was dead. I told him the Hikawa family had reached her first. That all I'd found was her lifeless body. Nothing more. The boss quietly accepted my report. The search for Akane-san was called off. And she was never spoken of again. Damn, I feel bad for him. So many hopes, crushed so many times. <sighs> and she has another life in After Hawaii. that, I stayed in contact with her, though sparsely. I needed some control over her so that she wouldn't suddenly get homesick for Japan, you see. You're a certified asshole. Still, I get that this all started because of what Akane-san said. I'm not saying everything you did was wrong. Well, with the boss now dead and me out of prison, the situation has changed. I wrote a letter to Akane-san. I told her everything there was to know. How I betrayed the boss, and that Ichiban Kasuga, the boy who grew up in a soap land, was her child. Ironic, isn't it? Neither I nor Akane-san were finally free until long after the boss was gone. <sighs> Anyhow, Ichi, Akane-san, she tells me she wants to meet you. She does? Me? Akane-san's home address. It's right there on the front. Is this a letter from Akane-san? It's just the envelope. The letter was to stay between me and her. I'm afraid I can't show it to you. Sure, I get that. Yeah, I'm sure it must be strange to be in your 40s and be asked to meet your mom for the first time. But Akane-san's only getting older. A son ought to set his mother's mind at ease before she passes on, don't you think? Well, yeah. This is just one more way for me to atone for all I've done. I'll be booking your flight to Hawaii. You'll leave tomorrow night. All that's left is how you feel about it. Will you go? Not for me, but for Akane-san. Please, won't you see her, Ichi? I would never expect him to bow to Ichi. Captain... He must be... serious. I beg you. You know, I never thought I'd see the day you bowed your head to me. Alright, I'll go see her. Well, I would have killed you if you'd said no. Man, prison and his son dying really mellowed Joe out. What's up? Hey, good to see you're still in one piece. Huh? Are you guys waiting for me? <laughs> Nambo was worried about you, and I somehow missed my chance to skedaddle. Look who's talking. That's what I was about to say. So, did you find out what Sarashiro's special request was? Mm. Yeah, uh, about that. Things got a little complicated. You don't say. Then, how about we head over to survive? Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. And I'm immediately turning off subtitle names, because that actually isn't needed.
Not needed. Raise your phone with this, and then. And do a silly sack smile. Do a silly and pose. Oh God, I hate that. Oh, I hate that. I hate that. I hate it so much. I don't even use Instagram. Smile. Do a silly face. Do a do do be 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 and pose. And I am not doing that ever again. I am not a selfie guy, Instagram guy, whatever. And that is a useless feature to me, so I'm not using that. Alright. Oh, look, the planters actually have plants in now. Well, time to tell them about my mom. I see. I see. Arakawa now found the Akani's alive as well. Maybe not, but Akani sounds like it was meant to be. Especially since Akani someone wanted to keep Arakawa in the dark about what have, what have you. Okay. Yeah, things changed after the boss passed. Who knows if she'd want to meet me otherwise. So what are you gonna do? You're gonna slip off to Hawaii? Ship off to Hawaii? Hey. Sure am. But it's not as much as, but not so much that I want to meet my mom. Really, it's more about paying my respects to the woman the boss loved. Kind of my sworn duty, you know. Okay. Well, I'm sure she'd like to see her son after so many years, especially given her age. Wait a minute, you've never battled the country before, have you? Okay. This will be my first time. Thing, nice thing is, I've already got the tickets. Captain Sarshiro's taking care of it. I'm guessing all I gotta do is get a taxi, then go from there. Sure. Sure, most tourist spots out there have Japanese speaker too. Huh? Really? Yep. There's been a lot of Japanese immigrants over the years. Honest. You mentioned traveling abroad to people about my age, the first place they'll think of is Hawaii. You know all those quiz shows from way back? The grand prize was usually a Hawaiian vacation for two. Huh. Hawaiian vacation for two. <laughs> Imagine if you went with Sachan. That'd be something, eh? Like she'd ever want, could say, ever say yes to that. So you guys haven't made up yet. <clears throat> the message I sent last year is still marked as unread. Oh, it's been a year since. Oh. Oh, it's been a year. Shit, really? Ugh. What the heck did I do wrong? Hold on. Hey, let's just forget about that. Yeah. And oh, yeah. Don't you need to pack? Yeah. Oh, right, right. Packing. Gotta pack for your big trip. And there's some stuff to know in advance, like watch out for white taxis. A lot of Japanese folk get scammed because crooks think we all look like mild mannered idiots. Mm. White taxis, huh? Oh, yeah, one more thing. Huh? Listen. Before you shove off, it might be a good idea to shop by, stop by Arakawa's grave, yeah? You're right. I should. Right. Right. Got it. All right, we'll visit him first thing tomorrow morning. For now, let's call the night. Hey now, no sense to moping about. Come on, that'd be the three of us. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Hmm. All right, packing must be done. Now we're gonna visit our cow and I'm gonna leave. Well, shall we? Now think about it. This is my first time visiting our grave. Yeah, same for me. Yeah. I haven't been there in a while, myself. Hang on, I'll guess a cab. Making sure? Listen, I'm an RPG guy. I'm just making sure there's no side quests. Also, I don't know if side quests are marked like in like a dragon or if they went back to the old Yakuza formula. Oh, yeah. Instead of the very bottom, they put them on the top now. Okay. Hey, Arakawa, young master. I'm taking off, boss. I'm gonna go meet her. Akane-san wants to see me. Arakawa, 
He had no clue Akane-san was still alive. Nor that you were actually his son. He never knew about any of it. You know, whether I'm the boss's blood or not, I can't actually say. Honestly, does it even really matter? Huh? To the boss, I'm just me. And to me, the boss is just the boss. His blood, my blood, it's not important. It doesn't change a thing. And that's why you won't take a DNA test? If it were me, I'd want to set the record straight. For all I care, I got two dads. I've got the boss right here, and I've got Jiro Kasuga, the man who stepped in when no one else would. That's good enough for me. If you say so. Man, you always gotta be so stubborn. Say, by the way, what's that in your hand? Oh, um, I've got some of the boss's ashes in here. Huh. You get that made somewhere? I want to give it to Akane-san. Uh, you know, provided she'll accept it. So that was it, huh? That's what made you decide to go? Maybe. For what it's worth, I thought it might make the boss happy. Be with the woman he loved. So, what do you think, boss? A little bit of her to be with the woman he loved. That's nice, but... Yeah, that's nice, actually. Why do I got a feeling this is not going to be as easy as it sounds? <laughs> I want to keep a con Adachi and Namba waiting. Should I head out to the station and snag a taxi for the airport? Okay, I get it. Now, the question is, how long is this chapter? Because I do want to listen to those radio shows, but I absolutely would hate to just, you know. One sec. Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. There's two ep- Oh, never mind. We'll listen to those later. They they put both episodes up. <gasps> Nancy Chan! What's up, Nancy? Nancy! That's my pet crawfish, of course. Nancy. I sort of bargained for her life with a homeless fisherman. She's been with me since. Yeah, Nancy! I stuck her in a clay pot as a joke, but turns out, she finds it pretty cozy. Oh, yeah. If I'm going to Hawaii, Nancy will need a sitter. Wonder who I could ask. Namba. Uh, a Dachi song, maybe? Huh? That a no? Uh, listen, if my stay in Hawaii goes long, you might dry out by the time I'm back. Fine, have it your way. We're in this together. You want to come to Hawaii with me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we have Nancy. Me and her. Hey, good girl, keep cool, Nancy. <laughs> me and my pet crawfish, Nancy. All right, guys, let's go to the airport. Which, well, we'll see how simple this trip is. I don't know, I get the... Oh. Huh? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Not Sujimon. Jeez, what the hell's up with this guy? Uh, just another crazy off the streets. Nothing out of the order. Huh. Does it feel like we've had this conversation before? Last game, yes. <laughs> Whatever. We know how to handle this. Roger. We'll knock some sensitive crazies. It won't hurt to kill a few more of their blood uh, brain cells. That's kicking time. Give me a second, <gasps> sir. Open one. Get lost. No begging for mercy now. Oh no, not heaven's door. Damn it. We lost Namba. Let's go! Hey! I'm a cop! Let's get it done! I'm trying to get him lined up, but it's not working very well. There it is. That's what I want. 
Yes! Oh. That's who I wanted. Now I'm a finished creep. I like this battle system with Justin, so I really do. What time is it? Now that I think about it, what time is it? Oh, I'll have to start getting ready for the gym soon. Man, what was his problem? I swear, this city's just as ugly as it ever was. Oh, ho. Uh -oh. a turn called titillator. Classic. You've not lost a step, Kasuga. How fortunate. Oh, it's the Sujimon professor. <laughs> it's been a while, my boy. You! Me. Uh, who were you again? <sighs> It's me, you fool! Professor Morikasa, the bloody Sujiman Sensei. Oh, Sujiman Sensei. Oh, right! I was just kidding. Of course I remember you, Sensei! Sujiman Sensei? This guy a friend of yours, Kasuga? We all saw him! You were with me when I met him. Yeah. He took us over to his, um, Sujiman Center, right? Come on, man. It's hard enough to remember the names of cute girls these days. Much less scarred up cue balls. <laughs> uh, if you say so. Uh, listen then, this guy's the Sujimon Sensei, the creep who researches other creeps. Let me fill up a whole catalog with data on them. The Sujimon. Yep. <laughs> Guilty as charged. More monster than man all, and inclined to make passersby feel super jittery. Sujimon! Uh-huh. Okay, yes. It's a stretch for the necessary classification. For society to rid itself of these violent creepers, research and categorization are vital endeavors. You see? As ever, my ultimate goal is world peace! No shit. This world... Despite all my efforts, it's still rotten with criminals and degenerates. Just look around you for proof. And so I collect data on them, their behaviors, their habitats, to help good, honest citizens stay clear of danger. That's why you needed Kasuga's help? Since he's always getting his ass kicked in the seediest parts of town? <laughs> right! It's coming back to me now. Well, Kasuga? Will you take up the Sujimon cause once more to be the very best? Huh? Uh, sure. You do still have the Sujidex installed on your phone, of course, don't you? Oh, hey, about that. You, you deleted my Sujidex app. All that data, gone. Hey, man, those things don't have much space. With no cloud backup. Ugh. Nothing to do but reinstall it. No, I gotta redo all the Sujimon from last game. <clears throat> Who's that Sujimon? The Sujidex is an app that records data about dangerous figures inhabiting the city known as Sujimon. Wait, inhabiting the city known. As, oh, okay, yeah, inhabiting the city known as Sujimon. Study up on their weaknesses, resistances, and skills to prepare prepare for your next fight. Defeating a Sujimon is all it takes to get their data, but if you lose a fight or escape, the entry will remain incomplete. Oh, what a pain in the ass. <laughs> Enough whining. You want to keep the world safe, don't you? Oh, wait, I forgot. I'm planning to go to Hawaii soon. Will this thing even work overseas? Huh? Well, it should, in theory. But... Why are you headed there, might I ask? I've got some stuff to take care of. My boy, Hawaii is known far and wide as a Sujimon paradise. What? Uh, really? Mm, one could call it an entirely different region of Sujimon. A tropical dreamscape, yet a land of shadows, blessed by the sun and the moon. In fact, I've even heard tell of some sort of Sujimon tournament there. Uh, how would that even work? <laughs> Perhaps. <laughs> we'll speak more of that when the time comes. Away now, my boy. To Hawaii you go for priceless Sujimon data. Uh -huh. Remember, 
gonna dispatch them all. Become the Sujimon master again. Whatever you say, Sensei. Uh... Okay. Going to Hawaii, huh? This might be my one chance to get it all back. Uh oh. Uh, so one thing I do know about the game, and one thing I heard through the things, is there's a class that revolves around Tsuchimon. That's all I know. Might as well just take a taxi. Um, no. Actually, the closest one is there. I'm an intellect. I'm smart. Alright, I'm gonna save it for a hop in this. Cause I got feeling stuff's about to either go down. I have no idea. Okay, which save am I saving on? I'll save on you. Anything but that one save in case I pull Metal Gear and not record for an hour. Earthworm. No real use for this. Well, I know there's fishing in the game now, so I'll hold on to it for fishing. Oh. Okay, yep, thank you. Oh man, I got that supreme herb. I'm gonna say that every time I pick it up, I don't even mean to. Alright. Guys, this is where I leave you. I'm gonna go on a trip, and it's gonna go just fine. It's gonna be a very easy trip, too. Hey, Ichiban. You sure you got enough stuff with you? I mean, it's Hawaii. Not a day trip up to some hot spring. You stay in there at least a few nights, right? Bring enough change of clothes? Hey, if I run out, I'll buy some. I hate dragging luggage around. Look at us. First we're homeless, and now we're stressing about extra clothes. Hey, you're right. We really moved on up. This might just be the R&R &R you needed. Take the time to enjoy it. Oh, and I'm good with any gift. But Magadine. Sure. Thanks, guys. So get Namba and Macadamia well, nuts. Guess I'm off. Happy travels. Probably nice to call them when they get to Hawaii and be like, I'm all right. Wait, do they. Do I have their phone number now that I think about it? Yeah, I'm not shocked they left the party. <laughs> Adachi and Namba left the party. You're going to Hawaii. Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. Oh, it's too early, I can't do that. <laughs> oh, those clouds look real. Put that back in your pocket before it falls out of your hand. Man, ain't nothing like a sunrise in Hawaii. <sighs> Man, that is pretty. Well, time to change. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be weird having actual, like, On behalf of all English of crew, people talking. Thank you for choosing to fly with us today. We hope to see you again soon. <sighs> No, no, no. Wait, careful, hold on. Oh, please, just just wait one second. Oh, guy uses a wheelchair and they're trying to pick him up. Hey, mind if I take over? Yes, please, thank you. No need to be so gentle with it. Just lift him by his belt here. Like a sumo in his loincloth. <laughs> See? Thanks for lending a hand, sir. We appreciate the help. No. If anything, I was being too nosy. I wouldn't call helping a stranger out nosy. I take it you've done this before? Well, an old friend of mine spent most of his life in a wheelchair, so... Ah, uh, yeah, that would do it then. Anyway, you here on vacation? Uh, we could say that, yeah. Right on. Well, let's make the most of it, huh? Later. Thanks again. 
Oh, uh, hui ho. Uh, who what now? Uh, 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 hui ho. It's like saying, until next time. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, hui ho! That guy's gonna come back up. Aloha. Aloha means family. Oh, this is gonna definitely look a lot different than Japan. <laughs> sure would be nice if the taxi driver spoke Japanese. I'm gonna look at the map immediately. Costco's money has been curved. Yeah! Oh, we have U.S. currency! It has been converted to USD. From this point on, any cash gained will be converted automatically when appro appropriated. Appropriate. Oh, appropriated. The exchange rate is fixed at 100 yen to a dollar. Yep. Hawaii is huge. I now have 56 dollars. Ouch. <laughs> I'm poor. So I got a feeling if I was playing with the language of Japanese, everyone here will be speaking English except some people. Hello, oh, do you speak Japanese? Well, this guy does not look like he cares. Aloha. Aloha. Uh, this mean anything to you? Oh, do I speak Japanese? Oh, you can read it! <laughs> you just come in from Japan? I got you. Now, uh, hop in. Oh. Hey, all right! Immediately, the first taxi I get, I get the Japanese speaker. All right. He oh, looks chill. Here's the address. Look familiar? Hmm, uh, that's a good ways away. Oh, really? Is it going to be a long drive? First time in Hawaii? <sighs> yeah. Cool. Welcome to the island. Uh, hope you have a nice time. I only got $56. If it's a long way away, I don't think I can afford this drive. Hey, so you're from Japan, right? I'd love to get out there one of these days. <laughs> you say that to everyone who flies in from Japan? Like this is a sales pitch? Nah, that's just how I really feel. Japan's a wonderful country. It's super peaceful. It's a great food. I uh, take away the peaceful part. Yeah, but what about Hawaii? This place is supposed to be heaven on earth, right? Well, the warm weather all year round is nice. But, uh, yeah, Hawaii's got its problems too. Ah, <sighs> go figure. And truth be told, we love Japanese guests out here. Uh, they make great customers, and we used to get a lot more before. Maybe you ought to bring your friends next time. Maybe. This time around's kind of personal. You know, you're a pretty upbeat guy, huh? <laughs> that an islander thing? <laughs> no, I, I get that a lot, that I'm easygoing. But I'm not all Hawaii. My dad was from Japan. Oh, really? Then is your mom from here? Yep. Huh. Hey, I guess you're the same as me. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Actually, I only found that out just recently. Hmm. Uh, hey, uh, sorry, but mind if I see that envelope again? I, I want to check the address. Oh, sure. <sighs> we almost there? I could have sworn it was more toward the suburbs when I looked it up. Uh-oh. Oh, is that right? Because somebody did their homework. Huh? 
Get out. Oh, God damn it. See, this is why I love the Japanese. Butter them up just a little, and they'll trust almost anyone. Should I be putting my hands up? Eh, you can stay as is, long as you're quiet. I'll want your wallet and your smartphone. And you know what happens if you say no. Oh, no. this is just a mugging? You're gonna shoot me? You? Really? You bet your ass. I ask because I don't think you can. Uh, uh huh? A lot of people say America's some gun crazy cowboy country. But I doubt many of those cowboys know what it really means to pull the trigger. Uh, th th the hell's your point? Uh, hey! You want to know if someone's going to shoot you? Look at their eyes. A little practice, and you'll get the hang of it. <laughs> yeah, he would know. Hey, hey! Didn't think Japan would know how to strike back, huh? Maybe now you'll think twice. God damn it! Don't get smart with me, asshole! Oh, okay, I'm gonna fight you. I'm gonna take my letter back. Crooked cabbie. Ass kicking time. Here, get away from me, man. Break yourself. Trust you. You're out of here. Get out of here. Let's get it done. Man, I cannot block today. Ass kicking time. Actually. Open wide! Get lost! Damn it! I screwed that up. Oh. That's an attack I didn't expect. I I am doing terrible. Luckily, I got items. Just eat this. Let's rock! You know, if it just did your job, you'd have got a fat tip. But now all you get is a fat lip. Oh, and give me my envelope. Uh, envelope? The one with the address, man. Uh, uh, oh. oh, yeah. Uh. Now what? You gonna turn yourself in? <laughs> Actually, it's uh, you I'm turning in. Huh? Yo! That's a Kane Sons! What the hell is wrong with you? Spit it out! <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Taxi Robin Dick. The fuck? Officer, help! I am being robbed! This hooter won my money and he pointed a gun right at me! Wait a sec! Don't tell me you're seriously buying this crap! Are you? Alright, alright, smart guy. Put your hands in the air and turn oh, around! Oh, that guy's Okay, dead. hang on! I, I'm doing it! Get on your knees! Look right now! 
I can explain. I swear I just got into town. I haven't robbed anyone. Come on, uh, arrest that scumbag. I'm pissing myself over here. Damn it. Why me? This is bullshit. <laughs> Better luck next time, asshole. Hold on, officers. That man is no thief. Oh, hey, you're the Ahuijo guy. Who you should be arresting is the driver. <laughs> He's the real thief. And if you need proof, I recorded the whole thing. Here. Oh man, thanks. Well, pay it forward. Hey, you saved my ass. Not even here a day, and I almost land myself in jail. Sorry you had to go through all that. I was surprised myself. Why are you here? Yeah, but what are you doing here? Well, actually, I was following you. Following me? <sighs> That's right. As we were leaving the airport, I noticed you had hopped into a suspicious-looking taxi. It looked suspicious? You could tell just by looking at it? And the thing is, I was born here. As it stands, I've got a bit of a, a sixth sense for it. I can tell if a driver's out to scam tourists or not. Oh. And he was setting off the alarm, huh? It's not like I was 100% certain about him. But you were so nice to me on the plane, and I imagined what might happen to you, and frankly, I just couldn't leave it alone. Well, thanks, man. You really saved the day. Oh, I'm Kasuga, by the way. Ichiban Kasuga. Kasuga-san? My name's Mitamura. Eiji Mitamura. Hey, that's a good name. So, Kasuga-san, where were you headed? If I may ask. I... Oh, shit! That's right! The address was on the envelope! The envelope? Was that what that driver ate all of a sudden? Yeah. I wouldn't know Kanye's address, though. Did... Oh. Did you copy the address somewhere? Search no. history. I didn't think I'd lose something. You said important. you looked it up. Search history. I see. Actually, hold on a moment. I might have something. Huh? You know what? I might be able to work with this. What? Are you serious? Oh, when you held the envelope I can see out. the envelope in the video I just took. It's too rough to read as is, but I can try tweaking the footage. And then we can read it? Yes, I think that should work. You'd really do that for me? Of course. In fact... I'd say this was meant to be, but I will need my laptop to enhance the video, so... If it's no trouble... Can I ask you to come to where I'm staying? Oh, sure! Well, I owe you big time, eh, chan Eh, chan You're A.G., right? So you're a chan Sorry, did, did I get a little too chummy? Oh, no. It's just been a while since anyone gave me a nickname. Anyway, should we get going? Mm. I have a feeling he has an ulterior motive. Actually, Kasuga-san, aren't you hungry? Oh, yeah. I haven't eaten anything since I got here. Could definitely grab a bite right now. In that case, why don't we do that? Yep, definitely I America. I haven't had anything either. <laughs> All right, first big Hawaiian meal. Let's do it. There's a place I used to go to pretty often. We can go there if you'd like. Uh, is there anything you'd rather not eat, Kasuga-san? Nah, I'm game for anything. People tell me I act like it's the best thing I've ever tasted, no matter what I'm eating. So, <laughs> <laughs> well, that's good to know. Yeah, if you're picking the place, then I'm ready to chow down. Just. Maybe we keep it cheap, because, you know, I'm kind of broke. No worries. It's a casual little place. <laughs> We're in business, then. Aloha. 
Two ladies in bikinis looking at a dog. Oh, man, going on a trip's great. You meet all kinds of new people. Shame about the first guy waving a gun in my face, though. Could have done without that. <laughs> I hear you. Still, all in all, that kind of thing doesn't happen too often. Honestly, I wonder if he's all right. You don't think he got shot or anything, do you? Uh, you worried about him? A guy like that? Well, I mean, the guy didn't seem evil. Not entirely, at least. <sighs> You're one of a kind, Kazuga-san. Not everyone could admit something like that. Especially about someone who tried to rob you. You don't think? <laughs> Maybe it's the island. The bigger the space, the bigger the heart, you know? Aloha Beach. Kasuga-san, what's the thing you think of when you hear Hawaiian food? Oh, uh, let's see. Loco Moco, I think? Oh, I know I've heard that one before. I mean, hamburger patties and sunny side up egg on rice? I'd bolt that down in two seconds. Oh, it is tasty. And these days, it's not just with hamburger. You can get it with chicken or even mahi-mahi. Mahi-mahi? Oh, it's a type of white fish. The big ones get up to about six feet or so. Wow, so is that like a Hawaiian specialty? If I caught a fish that big, I'd never shut up about it. <laughs> it makes for a good story. On that note, Kazuga-san, how long are you planning to stay in Hawaii? I don't know. I haven't decided, but I doubt I'll be here for too long. I'm not exactly here for sightseeing. Oh, then what for? Work or something? No, it's not for work either. Oh, yeah? Well, we've come this far, I guess. My mom and I were separated at birth, and apparently she's still alive. She lives out here now. I came out here to see her. You were separated? Hard to believe, right? It hasn't really hit me yet, either. Oh, it's any wonder. I can only imagine how difficult that must be. Wait, then, the address on that envelope you lost... Was that hers? Exactly. Would have thought some guy would eat the friggin' thing. You sure have been through a lot. <laughs> you know. One door closes, another opens. I mean, here I am now, having a great meal with my new pal. Pal? But you mean me? If it's okay with you, yeah. You've been a great friend so far. Kasuga-san. <clears throat> All right. I guess I'd better get you that address then. I can't let my new pal down, after all. Yeah, I'm counting on you. Hmm. Thanks. Man, that was good. Be great to come back here once things settle down. Glad you enjoyed it. Check out that view. All I usually get is nasty sewage canals, so this is really something. That's right. Yeah, definitely appreciate more than af uh, more after going away. Back then, I took it for granted. Oh, right. You said you were born over here. You visiting your family? Yeah. Yeah, you might say that. Always good to keep in touch. Mm. Gotta be tough on the wallet to come back to Hawaii every time, though, huh? Yeah, it's pretty harsh. I'll have to knuckle down at work next month. Oh, is your job pretty flexible? I'm a freelance engineer. I used to work full-time corporate, but it's a little awkward to stick around once I got in the chair. I see. Ah, uh, sure. If you're a freelancer, you could get all done from home, so it's a bit more liberal. A freelance engineer, huh? Well, hope you're paid accordingly. Huh? You know the trade? I worked at Hello Work in Yokohama. Got fired after a bit, though. Huh? You what? 
probably hard to respond to that. Don't worry. It's all good. Oh, no. It, it's not that. You said you were Yokohama. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, I was. And well, work fired you, so... Wait, Kazuga... What's up? Don't tell me. Are you the same Kazuga they talked about on the Totaro channel? Uh... Oh. Yeah, that's me. Mm. I knew it. Man, channel must be pretty famous, huh? I mean, yes. She said you've done some pretty heinous things, but frankly, I just can't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I appreciate that. Seriously, the whole thing was whack. It had to be. And that means you have to get her to take it back. Oh, you mean DM her or whatever? I tried sending one, but I never got a reply. And I'm not miffed about getting fired. I did some... ambiguous stuff in here and there. You... you really think so? Yeah, honestly. I don't really care about me and all this. What really gets me is all the people I drive down. You ever put through a whole unreasonable ordeal? about other people. Okay. Unreasonable is what happened to them. Ah, what the hell? No point getting all depressed with one of you like this. We all keep moving. Oh no! What was that? Uh, Kazuga? What's wrong, ma'am? Oh, right. English. The wind blew my scarf into the ocean. It's really special to me. Oh, uh, um... Her scarf blew in the ocean. She says it was really special. Leave it to me. Oh, is that right? Okay, I'm on it. <laughs> How's this? Hey, Chad. Can you ask her where she saw it land? I'll swim out and get it. Sure. Uh, right. Oh, that's a pretty big map I see there. I got a feeling there'll be more to come. All right. I'm actually going to save it here because... Oh, I can't save. Never mind, we're doing this. <laughs> Dirty can. <sighs> Is it? Oh. Garbage. <sighs> this is no. <laughs> A scarf. <laughs> Gotta be it. Damn it. Let's open the save. Oh well. So it was a gift from her late husband. Glad we got back. Right? Excuse me. Jumping in the ocean just like that. What were you thinking? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for the scare. Appreciate you playing navigator, Achon. Goodness. I haven't yelled like that in a while. Sorry. Well, sorry for that, too. Anyway, let's get going. Dress like that. Oh, right. Nearly it. Forgot. Okay, hang on tight. How do you rip up your pants like that? I want to know. Sorry for the wait. Now we can go. <laughs> Lead the way. I want to rip off everything like that. It's all... hmm? Wow. Those are some huge palm trees. Exactly what I picture when I think of Hawaii. Palm trees swaying over the blue sea. That about sums it up. Hmm? Is something wrong? Back in Japan, I'll often snag a permission off one of the trees in the park. Is that a no-go here? Mm. I'm not sure. I never thought about to do that. I doubt they'll put you in jail for it. Oh, seriously? Good to know. Huh? That's just a guess, though. Wait, what are you doing? 
Yeah, because in the original game, uh, there was a side quest where a persimmon was growing on a tree and a little girl was watching it from her window. Yep, yep. What do you mean? I'm grabbing some fruit. Huh? Pardon? I saw on this one anime when I was a kid. It looked so good. <laughs> I've always wanted to try it. Oh, wow, hang on. They sell coconuts and everything right over there. Sure, but isn't it better if you get it yourself? Much as I want to, uh, much as I want to climb, that's easier said than done. Mm. Maybe if you give the tree a good tackle. Are you serious? That's something a little kid would do. It would, would never. Her. <laughs> hey, look at that. What? Totally. All right. It even split open, and it's a full one too. All right, here it goes. Wow. Woo! This stuff's amazing! Oh, whoops. I'm just here gorging. Sup? Here. Cheers. Hey, John. No. Oh, no. That's okay. I'll pass. Come on. You gotta try. It's really good, man. Your throat's all dried out from yelling earlier, right? Quench it up. Huh? How did you know that? I heard the cough a mile away. Here. It's good to try new things. Sure. All right, uh, get me here. This is really good. <laughs> I told ya. I never thought I'd get one straight from a tree like this. I can't remember the last time I did something so childish. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good time, right? No harm, uh, no harm if we goof off uh, now and then. Eh, well, moderation's key, I suppose. Anyhow, we should get going. It's be dark before long. Got it. Oh, right. Let's be on our way then. Can I save, please? No? Okay. Wow. Hey. Pretty hap. Pretty happening spot. It's like this all day here. There's a lot of stores around too. I'll say. Good place to pick up some souvenirs. Hmm? Hmm? What's wrong? Hey, Chong, what's up over there? Mm. Uh, that? They're probably just trying to pick her up. They tend to go after the tourists around here. Well, it's not unheard of. She looks kind of upset, though, huh? Yep. I'd certainly say so. I see. Figure as much. I thought maybe it'd be different overseas, but nope. Sorry, man. Think you could just wait for me over here for a second? Okay. Ah, Kazuka son. Not again. I said no. Come on, babe. You don't gotta be scared. Come with us. It'll be fun. Hello there. Uh, Arden, me. The fuck you want? Hmm. That? Oh, shoot. Person there. What's the word? Dude, lady. That lady there. She is trouble. Not good. Okay. What the hell's this guy on about? Huh? Shit. Maybe their English sucks too. The lady. She is trouble. No good. Hey, piss off. Or what? You're gonna get your face smashed? Oh. Oh, now this I understand. English is one thing, but fighting words are another. What are you doing, Kazuka-san? Hey, hey, Chan. Maybe taking that lap. I'm. I think I'm about to throw down. Now you're being reckless. Things might be get a little rowdy, so don't get too close. Normally I wouldn't, but I'm not about to leave you hanging. At least let me offer some support. Seriously? Well, all right, pal. <laughs> you fellas want to go? Then step right up. Cool. This guy thinks he's hot shit, huh? Let's splatter him. Got some low lives. I'll show you. Now's your chance. Oh. time. Open wide. Oh, wipe out. 
You have no idea Let's what you just did. Oh, damn it. Now they're next to each other. Never mind. Ow. My bad. Sorry, man. We learned our lesson, honest. They said they learned their lesson. I see. I'll bet. So, did I master English yet, or what? You're asking me. Sorry about all that. You're safe now. Oh, no need to thank us or anything. It was no big deal. Thank you for saving me. Ah, you're so handsome. Maybe let me say thanks. My hotel's just down the street, hmm? Come on, I promise it'll be fun. Mm. Oh, I, uh... Hey, I helped out too, you know. Sorry, I guess I was more her type. <sighs> <laughs> well, she clearly just doesn't appreciate a more rugged older man like myself. Anyway, it was good to enjoy the island a bit. About time we head over to your place, huh? Excuse me. Actually, why don't we grab a quick bite first? The sun's about to set. There aren't too many stores where, we, uh, where I'm staying. True that. Know any good spots around here? Hmm. We could always do the cafe over there. They have a great tuna salad sandwich. Sure thing. The cafe, huh? Got it. I'll go grab us a couple of sandos. So sit tight. Thank you. That's very kind. Let me save, 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 let me save. Thank you. Excellent, I can save. Alright, so we'll continue this next time. We're officially in Hawaii. It's a pretty good looking Hawaii so far. But until then, we'll see where this all goes. We'll maybe I'll be visiting my mother next episode, but who knows? But Fujimon League? Oh dear. But until then, I'll see you next time, and well, bye. I'll see you. Bye-bye.